welcome to this week's video. As you can tell by the title, we're doing a winter makeup look because it is winter here in New Zealand. It's literally pissing down outside. There is no leaves on my trees. It's just a miserable time, but I want to glam up winter. And winter is sort of darker colors because it's gloomy, but I want to look fierce. So that's today's video. So my headband's totally not wintry. For those concerned though, this is coming along. It's finally healing up, but what an eyesore. The eyes. The eyes are the nipple of the face. Do you remember that movie? House Bunny? Classic. I use my Eye Dream Eye Cream. I dream shadow cream that I got from Toasty Class. And I'm just gonna put that on there. Makes my eyeshadow stay on longer, go on smoother, and appear more like pigmented because I just use drugstore or two dollar store products. You want it to sort of amp up then your makeup a little bit. I'm going to be doing quite a deep purpley look because Winter, you know, like clouds, purpley darks. EXO Beauty Round Top Blender Brush, and I'm going to go with. We'll start with quite a light purple. Oh, light purple. I'm going to go with this shade here and put that in my crease. Sorry if you can see a shadow. Hello banana again. Ooh, my face. And go in with a deeper shade of purple. Probably match those two together on the outer V. We're just playing. I'm gonna slowly blend that in all over the eye. Really light, let's just gonna blend in a little mahogany and mix it into the eye corner, corner again, making it appear more of a, a deeper purple. Just giving a makeup wipe and cleaning up the edges. I'm going to blend that out in a minute. Gosh, imagine if we did our makeup like this. Okay, then I'm getting another rounded blendy brush. Here, I'm gonna get a white colour and use that to blend the purple out and blow it out so it doesn't look as harsh. <laughs> Ooh, see what blending can do. A dark, the dark purple again, and mix it with that mahogany again, like what we did on the outer V, and I'm gonna run that underneath my eye. Might add in a bit of black into the creases just to make them more wintry, darker with my blendy. The black has got a bit of glitter in it as well. Darken up that purple even more. I've got this little grey shimmer shiny colour. I'm just going to grab that on there and dab that on. gets excited about playing with makeup. I'm just like, oh, I've got this here. I'm going to use this. It's actually a lot nicer purple ones than this one. I should have looked at this one first. Yeah. And just put that up there. The black eyeliner on my waterline but I just learned a new technique which I'm going well I didn't learn a new technique I saw a new technique and I'm going to give it a go so what you do is you get your black eyeliner and you rub it on your eyelashes and sort of on that little bit of skin underneath oh. so it's looking quite dark but what I'm going to do is get a 
really little brush and blow it out so just rubbing it back and forth back and forth making it look really smoky Elf liquid liner and do a pretty dramatic wing so wish me luck guys to be done with this look now. <gasps> Color Madly Matte Lip Gloss and it's just this Sorry the lighting's bad and I can't go with that. Right then I'm getting this True Matte in Nikak New York which is seven dollars. I'm not sure where this one's from. Right, so the falsies are on. I'm just gonna add some concealer and sharpen up my wing. I'm just going to do my hair and I'll be right back. Here I am again, floating through the silence in my cold skin. My body is wearing thin. My fears tell me I'll never win. My body is wearing thin. After all of that with the eyeliner and the lipstick not going on, I'm actually really happy with that. I was like really doubting the eye. I was like, oh my god, I've got my eyeshadow like right up to my eyebrow. Oh, my teeth. See, last week I put on bold red and made my teeth look grey. This makes my teeth look really yellow. But my tongue looks really pink. Look. <laughs> anyway, okay. So I hope you liked that one guys, if you did give it a big thumbs up and if you want to see more of me, hit subscribe, the girl in the corner. I do have a subscriber goal and it's to get to 100 before the year is out, so I think I'm at 84 at the moment. Oh, that's more than I ever thought I would actually have, so still really stoked with that, but I do have a goal of 100. Set damn goals, girls. Okay, radio. See you guys. Mwah. Bye. It's it looks so prim and proper. Oh my god, why? <sighs> so yeah, um, I'll see you all next time. Bye!